What's up guys, Alex here, and today I got the brand new Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 5 on the table here in front of me. And what we're gonna do is go ahead and go through the initial setup process of this phone. So if you're somebody who's maybe new to the Galaxy lineup of phones, or maybe you just want to get a refresher on how to set up your phone for the first time, this video is for you. Now we are gonna skip the unboxing because let's be honest, there's not really much to unbox with phones these days. You pretty much just get the phone, a cable and a SIM ejector tool. So we're gonna skip all that, get this phone powered up and get set up for the first time. All right, it's alive. All right, guys, so here we go. Once our phone is powered on, we're going to be greeted with this welcome screen. At this point, you can just select your language. I'm going to leave it English and we're going to hit start. And here's just going to ask you to agree to their user license agreement and their privacy policy. Now you can tap agree to all here, but I actually like to deselect this one because what it's going to do is send diagnostics data to Samsung. And you can see it does say optional. And I just don't like my phone constantly sending data over to Samsung. So if you want, go ahead and disable this one as well, but you will need to agree to, to these two. So go ahead and agree to those and then tap agree down here. And now on this page, you have the option of transferring all of your data from your old phone. So if you have another Galaxy device like my S23 Ultra, or an Android device like a Google Pixel device or an iPhone, you can transfer all of your data from your old phone over to your new phone. Now, if you don't want to do this right now, you can just skip this step for now. But I'm going to do is to just tap Galaxy right here. And you can see it's going to give me a QR code that I need to uh, scan with my old phone. So I'm just going to pull up my camera here. All right, there we go. You can see it says continue on your old device on here. It's just asking me to verify my identity. So I'm just going to scan my fingerprint. Now it says continue setup on your new device. So now you can set your old device to the side. All right, here we're just gonna hit next, tap next again. Here's just asking permissions to all of your settings on your phone. So obviously we're gonna hit allow. And now what you can do is transfer wirelessly or use a cable instead. Now, if your phone is maybe old, your old phone, if it's really old or low on battery, you can use a uh, wireless transfer and keep it connected to a power source. But if you want the uh, transfer to go faster and you have lots of battery, you can use a cable instead because it will be faster using a cable. And there is a cable that comes with your uh, Galaxy Z Flip 5. So you can go ahead and use that. So I'm just gonna say use cable instead. And you can see it's a USB-C to USB-C cable. So I'm just gonna plug these into each other. And there you go. You can see it's starting to transfer. So right here, we're gonna say, okay. And here is going to ask you what you want to transfer. So you can transfer everything. You can see I have 44 gigabytes worth of data. You can transfer just calls or contacts, or you can do a custom transfer. So if you tap onto here and then tap next, you can see that it will actually show you all of the applications and everything on your phone, all the messages on your phone, all your calls and contacts, all of your apps. And if you want to transfer only specific apps, maybe not everything, you can tap on this arrow and then specifically select which apps you want to transfer. So you can go through here and select whatever you want manually, or you can just go back and tap everything, which is what I'm gonna do. And then we're gonna hit next. If you wanna transfer your secure folder, just put in your pin, tap next. And there you go, you can see the transfer has begun. Now, while the transfer is going on your old phone, you can actually go back in here and continue with the setup wizard. So we're just gonna tap accept. And here you have the option between setting up face recognition, your fingerprint, pin, password, or pattern. I'm just gonna set this all up later. We're gonna hit skip for now. And here you can set up your Google Assistant. Again, I'm gonna skip this because you can set this all up later. I don't wanna make this too long. And then here, we're just gonna again tap skip. All right, now it's gonna ask us if we want any of these recommended apps. I pretty much always just disable this. I don't need any of these recommended apps. So we're gonna remove those and then tap next. And then here you can set up your Samsung wallet. Again, I'm just gonna skip this for now. You can do all of this later, so don't worry about it. And then here, we're just gonna agree to all of these Samsung services because I do want all of these uh, available on my phone. So we're gonna tap agree, tap next here. And there you go, you can see we are all set up. So now all we gotta do is hit finish. And then I think it's actually going to take us through a tutorial on how to do swipe gestures. Okay, maybe not. But there you go, you can see that now this phone looks exactly like my Galaxy S23 Ultra. If I unlock it, you can see that it is an exact mirror of my phone. I got my wallpaper, all of my applications, and everything has been transferred to my new phone. You can see that these applications are still dulled out because they are actually still being uh, downloaded. You can see that the transfer is actually still happening in the background. So this could take a while depending on how much stuff you're transferring. If we go into here, it tells you how much time is left. It says 44 minutes left. 
So all you gotta do now is just sit back, relax, and let the transfer complete. But there you go, guys. I'm not gonna keep you here for 44 minutes. That's pretty much everything you need to do to set up your new Galaxy Z Flip 5 and transfer all of your data from your old phone to your new phone. If you guys wanna see tips and tricks videos, be sure to stick around and subscribe because I'm gonna be doing a lot of videos on the Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 5. I also got the new Galaxy Watch 6 Classic and of course the Tab S Plus. So if you wanna see videos on those devices, be sure to subscribe. But for now, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.